This is Vonnegasm. Today we're in Marblehead, Massachusetts, and we're going to be going on a hike to Mount Madagna. <laughs> Where are we going? Mount Madagna. Oh, is that what it's called? Mount Madagna. Yeah, we're still in Massachusetts. We're going to be heading up there for the day. But there's one thing that's really, really always important to do before going on a spiritual journey such as this, and that's to make sure you have a full stomach. So, and we're going to this really special five-star breakfast place. What's it called? In bagel wells. <laughs> we're gonna jump in the car, go grab, go grab some bagels, and then we're gonna head up this bloody mountain, aren't we? And just do some hiking stuff. Bagel world is fucking lit, dude. So lit. So pumped. So fucking, I love this place. Yeah. Fucking. Bagel world, dude. Oh, yeah. That bagel world, bitch. Oh, I'm at it. Emily made a very good point of bringing toilet paper in case somebody needs to do like a bush poo or something. That'll probably be you. You're always probably pooing. me. Always. <laughs> poo. This is like a two and a half hour walk to the top, so make sure you poo beforehand. Make sure you do a poo before. It's actually um, on the sign at the bottom yeah. of the mountain. It says, "Have you pooed before starting this journey?" <laughs> <laughs> Let's do it. Let's do it. Alright guys, so uh, we're about halfway to Mount Mungla Mungla Boo Mananak We're in a new state now, we've left Massachusetts, we're in New Hampshire This is Mango Mike and he's going to tell you all about New Hampshire So the motto is, live free or die <laughs> <That's it. laughs> The whole state's mountains, right? Yep. Mountains everywhere, it's pretty lit <laughs> Anyway, we're going to go we'll show you We'll show you, we'll show you <laughs> Make it clap, we got gas on the Oh, fuck around and know the This dude here has just spent his whole time working in his heart, ripping bongs and growing his beard. And now he's telling... He's probably, he's probably been growing that for about two years. Him how to grow... I better, get, I better get stuck in his coffee. <laughs> I better get stuck in his coffee. All right, guys, we're just about to enter Mount Neb Nebuchadnezzar uh, National Park. <laughs> we're just waiting to go up now. Right now where we are is Ground Zero. This represents our spiritual awareness. We're currently at the base of the mountain. The higher we ascend, the more spiritually aware we'll become on a spiritual journey. Guys, are you ready to become spiritually enlightened? Yes. Pike, ready? Oh yeah, brother. <laughs> Let's do this. These dudes have been talking for about 20 minutes now. Share the spiritual enlightenment, dude. Don't hog it all, fuck. Is that it? Uh, easy crops? isn't in our vocabulary. <laughs> yeah. Like Main trails are done. All right, cool. Uh, we recommend that for up in the crops. X for down, down. okay, yeah. got it. Is there a bathroom down the road? Yeah. Alright guys, so we're here at Mount Manitowabala uh, National Park. It's about a four mile round trip hike, two hours up, hour and a half down. So, yeah, it should be pretty dope. We're going to go up there, take some photos, maybe camp out for the night. Probably not though. I'm just really ready to be spiritually enlightened, you know? Just been looking forward to this for a while now, so let's start the journey. Guys, I've actually been here for about 10 minutes on my own now. Everyone's just fucked off and left me at the bottom of the mountain. What's going on? Where are all my friends? I guess I'll just hang out in the car for a few hours then. Where do you think you've been? Leaving me on my own? We did a wave. Mm, God. Yo, who's ready for a fucking spiritual adventure? Hell yeah, mate. Hell yeah, mate. <laughs> Hell yeah, mate. Emily Dunham's nearly got the Aussie accent. Oh shit. Emily Dunham is, like she's good. You are Aussie, I'm right? <laughs> Guys, have you heard about the top of this mountain? What's Wait, at the top? We're not going that way though. Oh, oh yeah, I knew that. The main trails. So we've been hiking for 10 minutes now. The girls already stopped for a break. Only two hours to go. The boys are going strong though. We're we, good. Got, we got this, we got this. Jesus. Yeah, we're good. We're uh, 1 16th of the way up. So far, no one's died. Careful of that caterpillar. And he spoiled a chipmunk. She's gonna go whisper it. He doesn't wanna talk to you. Sorry, dude. Maybe I'm just delirious and he doesn't actually exist. Maybe none of this exists. 
What is the meaning of all of this? I feel really spiritually enlightened right now. I'm feeling about like I've leveled up in my spiritual. Yeah, I'm like a level two shaman now. <laughs> Mountain climber Annie. Here she goes. Halfway up. Yeah. Guys, how spiritual are you feeling? Holy fuck. I think I'm dying. That's pretty spiritual, dude. Annie? <laughs> She's so spiritual, she I'm, can't I'm even talk. Like, nearly, I think I've gotten over the spiritual enlightenment. Like, I've leveled up to heaven and now I'm dying. It's pretty deep, man. It's pretty intense. So you get about halfway up and it levels out. And rumor has it, this is where they actually filmed the Blair Witch Project. No. Um, <laughs> yeah. Not. No. And uh, if you wander off the track a little bit, you can actually see some of like the stick figures. And apparently in the last five years, seven people have gone missing on this path. <laughs> Annie? No. I don't know why you take me to these places. <laughs> so Annie, how do you feel about the Blair Witch Project? And um, it's also where they filmed Scream Free. So, Scream's not scary. So you're not worried about that? Just no, the Blair, Blair Witch is scary. Oh. Because she like takes people and then there's fingers and like fingers them. presents and woods. Like, so yeah. should we go off the path and Blair see if we can find some Absolutely Blair Witch? Absolutely not. So we're going to do that, yeah. Cool. And he's ascended so spiritually that she's now got a shaman stick. I just I feel like one with the nature. Um, got to get to the top and do a, uh, a small you ritual. You need food up here because the amount of bugs that you eat, you can survive off for like well, at least 27 hours. Well, there we go. We're gonna go get some bugs and fucking, <laughs> fucking just fucking send it, dude. Send it. Send it. Emily's hands <laughs> swell up when she's in nature. Apparently, they get like balloon hands. <laughs> They're like super not cute. Like no guy could even hold my hand like this. It's just kind of like. Fit. But it only happens in nature, not aeroplanes. Only in nature. <laughs> So, it's like nature yeah, fucking up. hates me. Okay, I'm gonna stop vlogging because I don't want to fall down there. Guys, important piece of hiking information. Just follow the white dots, dude. They'll get you there. Look at that view. Oh my gosh. Wait, Mike, look out. I'm gonna get an artsy photo for you so your Instagram doesn't suck. Oh! Bloody rip, eh? We're just up here sending it, guys. <laughs> you can see for absolute miles across New Hampshire. Look at that. You can't tell on the camera, but that goes for a very long way. Bloody beautiful. So this point here is actually the spiritual peak barrier. So you pass through this point and you've actually ascended to a higher level. You can oh, speak to chipmunks. So Annie, oh my God, did you feel that when you pass through? Oh, I can, I can feel it in the air. Man, it's oh, this. this is so spiritual, dude. So enlightened. <laughs> Guys, we've discovered the area where the Blair Witch was buried. Um, right there under that rocks is the fabled Blair Witch. 17 people, guys. 17 people went missing here. So we're like basically near the top. The peak is there. Wait, can you guys turn this way? It's a bit more of a walk over, so I think we're going to head that way. But the view from here is pretty lit. Look at them views. So uh, I need to just come across another burial ground. So we've. Uh, R.I.P. <laughs> Kinos. I have it on good word that we're eight minutes from the very top. Good word. <laughs> this is absolutely bloody stunning. Amazing. You made it to the top. Having a, having a quick bite and then we'll probably um, Have a little sleep. Yeah.
that was pretty dope. You can see all the way into Virginia over there from the top. Um, I hope this is focused. I think it is. Anyway, you can see all the way into Virginia. Um, yeah, it's definitely worth the hike. What was it, like an hour and a half we took to get up here, if that? Yeah. Yeah, we're going to head back down now. The guys have gone ahead because they couldn't keep up with the spectacular views. So yeah, let's do that. Let's go! I feel, I mean, Annie, how spiritually aware are you now? I'm very spiritually aware. Like a level 20 spiritual, spiritual awareness now, so. Spiritual. So I'm going to go home, have a few out of body experiences and then just fucking go to sleep. It's going to be sick. P.S. I hate heights and this climb down is going to be pretty fucking interesting because there were some slippery routes on the way up. <laughs> So we figured out that these aren't graveyards for witches from the Blair Witch. I think every time someone makes it up to a certain point, they add a rock to this pile. So we're gonna add some rocks. I need to grab a rock, hang on. I'm gonna get a big one, because I'm fucking extra. All right. Uh, let me check <gasps> No. You broke? No, I did it, we're good. You broke it. No, we're good. I feel like I'm one with the mountain now. I'm even more spiritual. Guys, we're on a fucking mountain. I don't even wanna talk about it anymore. <laughs> Emily Dunham is. Oh wait, are you I Emily? Wait, are you yeah. Emily Dunham? Oh Guys, look who I bump into on the mountain. I can't believe it. It's Emily Dunham. Emily Dunham is dead. Hello, oh. Mango Mike. Wait, 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 we don't go that way. Oh. We have to oh, she's been fighting. We have oh God, it's beef. Back. Bird beef. We're, we're a touch lost. Um, <sighs> might have to spend the night up here. Um, I mean, this guy good. Like, I mean, we we'll can, be alright. We can outrun a bear. These girls though, I don't know. <laughs> Tell you this for nothing, it's definitely a lot easier coming down than it is coming up. Fuck me. Okay, but for real, me and Annie have lost the group. I think we're lost. We might actually be lost for real this time. Like we don't remember coming through trees and wood chips on the way up. And I haven't seen a trail marker in a while. Yeah. So. And the trails just disappeared. No, the trails kind of. Em! Let's go back up this way. We're actually lost. Should we just cross through because... Okay, we're turning back. Is this like in like horror films when they walk and then they go past something they've seen already and they've just been going in circles. This is legit the Blair Witch. Fuck. Yo, we might have got lost, but we got those fire shots though. <laughs> At least we got some good for video. Where the fuck are we? Oh, I hear strangers in the yonder. We might be saved. We found a white dot, we're safe. No, but I'm worried for them because I don't think they went this way. Well, they're probably dead now, Annie. Oh, God. It was nice knowing them. Jeez. I mean, it was good while it lasted. Yeah, exactly. There is that white dot. All right, guys, we found a white cross, which is the path back down. So we're uh, officially no longer lost. I know, I know my way around mountains, it's fine. <whistles> guys, I'm talking to a bird, listen. Shh. Come on, dude, don't leave me hanging. Dude, I swear it's them doing it as a joke. <laughs> no, I'm talking to animals. It's like the, the Hunger animals. It's like the Hunger Games with the mocking jet. That's actually the sound it is. <laughs> it's them. Probably, in the bushes hiding from us. Come on, we've got to jump across this massive lake. There's, I think, I think there might be, be gators in this one. And he reckons we're about halfway down. Maybe. I'd say we're probably at least halfway down, if not further. I can semi breathe again, so I feel like we're halfway. You can semi breathe, semi but you're not breathing before. Well, no. Oh, ah! It's impressive. Oh. Sorry. <laughs> she alright? Yeah. I spy with my little eye something beginning with R. Rock. Oh, she got it. Alright, your turn. <laughs> I spy with my little eye something beginning with. Oh, there's a fly on the lens. B. Oh, that's a hard one. Mm. Uh, bark. Oh. Fuck. You got it. I reckon this game's going to be too easy. We'll better call it a, call it a day. <laughs> so as we come back back down the mountain, I can feel the spiritualness levels beginning to to lower again. Um, I definitely still feel quite enlightened, but you know. Just not at that same level I was before. <sighs> yeah, it's, it's 
it's just emotional, you know. So, uh, we made it back down to the bottom. Um, I'd have to rate that hike on a spiritualness level, probably like a, a seven for a spiritualness level. What do you think? Yeah? I'd it's give it like seven, seven and a half. Seven, seven and a half. I mean, I think we're all pretty agreeable on a spiritualness level, like definitely ascended to a higher plane. Um, I would recommend it to anyone else out there who is an advanced spiritual leader or higher. Um, but yeah, what is the actual name of this place? I've called it about 10 different names. What is it? Mount? Mount Manadnock. Mount Manadnock. Uh, pretty dope hike, dude. Fucking, I'm bleeding all over because I've been eating alive. But yeah, that's it. This dude's getting fucking bullied by a wasp. <laughs> Shit. Where is it? It's still there, it's still on you. Just just be relaxed. No, it's on your back. Turn around slowly. I'll kill it. Wait, no, he's gone, he's gone. He's gone, it's gone, it's gone. Fuck. That was fucking tense. Anyway guys, we're leaving New Hampshire. We're heading back to Massachusetts. Sick.